Now to the shocking accusations of sexual abuse at a Buddhist temple in Santa Ana. Eight women have now come forward saying that they were assaulted as children at the temple. They say the temple had a culture of abuse. As that what news reporter Jessica DeNova tells us, a criminal trial is set to begin on Monday and there is a lawsuit. Really needed somebody to protect me at that time. I thought it was just me. The tears, pain, and trauma these two women share are all too familiar for Ivy Pham. Tina Le and T. Wind say when they were young girls, the head monk of the Bat Nab Buddhist Temple in Santa Ana sexually molested them. Their story empowered this 26 year old to speak out. This isn't the first time, like, I'm giving my inner child a voice, like, I'm standing up for her. Ivy says when she was just 11, a youth leader at the temple, a man in his 50s grabbed her breasts. I was just in shock and I was frozen. I couldn't move. And then I felt his like penis just like on my back. Feeling ashamed, it took Ivy a while to open up to her mother. Ivy says her mom reported this to the head monk. That's Titch Wintree, the same man Tina and T are suing. But Ivy says the head monk did nothing. And it seemed the monk not taking action to remove him at all. That like infuriated me. Two other women spoke with Eyewitness News Thursday with similar accusations against the same youth leader. They're considering going to police and hope their stories bring awareness. Because it's not just for me, but it's just up for like other people as well. I hope this kind of guides like young girls or boys to speak up if this ever incident ever happened to them. We've learned more details about the criminal case. The women originally went to Santa Ana Police in 2017, but the suspect wasn't interviewed by officers until 2021. One of the officers assigned to the case in a deposition by opposing counsel admits it's because the files were misplaced. The case was then filed with the Orange County District Attorney's Office just this past summer, more than five years after the women originally reported this to police. We're waiting to hear back from the police department and the DA's office whether this had anything to do with their criminal case being rejected. Reporting in Orange County, Jessica De Nova, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV and Roku to watch on your TV.